Welcome to MCOM Solutions, Jake here. Today I got a radio that might help solve some of your communication problems. So Spec5 recently started selling their Pulse Pack radios, which combines a Beofang FRS radio with a LoRa module. So now you have two-way voice and secure messaging and location sharing using the LoRa module all in one package. So we're going to take a look at that today and if you stay to the end you'll hear about a little bit of an announcement about something new coming out from spec 5 in the near future so let's take a look at this radio so jumped over to spec5.com you're going to see here the pulse pack is going to get is going to cost you 239.99 this includes two radios and accessories i'll show you those here in a minute but you see it looks like a typical baofeng style uh, FRS radio, but now they've incorporated the LoRa module. It is a ESP32. I'm guessing probably Helltech, maybe a little ago, but uh, already configured for 915 megahertz for the U.S. market. Internal battery is 1,800 milliamp hours. They're saying about uh, about eight hours of uh, operation. Of course, of battery life, there's a lot of variables to that. That's probably the best case scenario because you know environmental conditions can imp impact that and your use. If it's a if you're using the two-way voice communication uh, through the FRS function, you know you're going to probably if you're using that a lot, you're going to see a much lower battery life. So, um, <clears throat> and then it has two external antennas. So one is the UHF antenna for the FRS two-way communications or voice communications and then you have an external LoRa antenna a 915 megahertz antenna and there's an the internal GPS ceramic antenna you're going to see of course with your LoRa about one to three miles urban and three to five rural those are pretty good um, general rules of range for LoRa and then with the FRS you're going to see around two miles and of course just like any line of sight radio, there's you still need to be in line of sight just because someone's only a mile away. But there's uh, a mountain in between you two. Then it, guess what? It's not going to work. <laughs> so, um, and then and then it has. So they do claim that the eight hours of active use in a 24-hour standby time. So uh, it probably has something in there that goes into a power saving mode or something like that to keep it from draining the battery so if you have it on but you're not using a bunch you might see two hours or 24 hours um, so the case is a robust pet g material uh, i think there's a combination of yeah it says they're also durable pet g asb uh, case it is does not at least according to this have any sort of ip rating so of course you're going to need to protect this in some way within like a, a radio pouch or something like that if you're going to be operating out in the weather which this radio would be great for like search and rescue you know operations any or outdoor activities would be a good uh, a good radio for that and then um, there is so the pack does include the the pulse radios a dual charger uh, wired earpieces belt clip and lanyard so everything you need right and then of course with this there because it's frs and Laura, there's no licensing required. So you can buy this and use it, you know, the day you're, it arrives and you don't have to worry. You do have two options for firmware configuration, Mestastic or ATAC. Um, you know, if you're using Mestastic already and you also have ATAC, you can just do the Mestastic plugin and, and operate it that way too. So a little more on the specs is 145 grams, which is like 5.1 uh ounces about and then range the course the typical or pre-programmed frs channel 16 channels the lower chip is a 1262 it has one megabyte of ram and the flash is 256 kilobytes battery 24 hours it is good feature right USB C 5 volt chargeable so very easy to charge you know in your car using your typical charger you might have already for your phone or about a backup battery bank that you could have on hand to give you additional days of operation uh, if you jump over just accessories oops sorry not accessories what's included as already mentioned 
two radios, one charger, but it's a dual charger, so you can charge both radios at once. Um, two ear wired earpieces and then two bill clips and two lanyards. So not a bad deal for... So final thoughts here, these radios help solve some emergency communications problems. So if you're maybe new to this, you may not realize that a lot of times you buy a radio and it kind of has one capability. So then you need to buy another radio if you want to expand your capabilities. So by pairing two radios, two, yeah, two radios together, you now have voice communications and then secure uh, text messaging and GPS location sharing along with the mapping features you can use in like ATAC or uh, a mesh application of some nature. So this kind of helps just build so you don't have to buy a bunch of different radios to do one thing. Now, all on one radio sometimes can be a problematic because if that radio fails, you might be relying on it for more than one capability. So make sure you build a good pace plan when you're developing your emergency communications plan. So where would I love to see this go? I would love to see the same kind of setup but in a five watt GRMS radio. Therefore, you're, you have more power, so you you're, should get more depending on obviously conditions and situations and terrain and all those good things, um, you should be able to get more direct voice communications, then add in the GRMS repeater frequencies, add in your own portable GRMS repeater, or if you already got one in your local area, now you've expanded the range of voice communications within your area of operation. So that would be really cool. I would love to see that feature. What features would you love to see? I did recently just partner with Spec5 and they have a firmware that's coming out that's similar to you know, like Mestastic and others. It's called HyperMesh. And you know, a little hint here or sneak peek, I will be getting access to that before the general public. Don't know exactly when, but in the future, I'll be doing a video on that showing you its capabilities, compare it and then compare it to like Mestastic. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out our social media links, our website, Subscribe to the channel, hit that thumbs up, and stay tuned for more emergency communication solutions videos. Thanks for watching.